Good morning, morning. Cubs. Today is Wednesday, March 2nd, and we are running on a day one schedule. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance, followed by a moment of silence. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. You may be seated. So, I feel really bad about this, but I said Tuesday was Crazy Sock Day, but today is actually Crazy Sock Day. Uh, so It's okay. We all make mistakes. I got I have help. a ton of weird socks that my mom always gives me for Christmas. You know, my mom gives me a lot of weird socks too, and I like I have these ones with like dog faces on them and like little tongues. So like, it's just socks. I don't know. I Anyways, just, they're just in my drawer. They are. I don't actually like. I like rarely wear socks. I'm gonna be honest. Yeah, I wear them around our house a lot, but we keep our windows open because I like the fresh air. Yeah, when and then the chilly. child gets cold. Yeah. Hmm. Okay. okay, for lunch today, boys and girls, we have Kung Fu egg rolls, and then we have under the sea tuna sandwiches, and again, the the best, the BB and J sandwich. So just tons of good, yummy snacks. Lots of good options. Yeah. Okay, we so we have a new person that we're focusing on this month, oh. month for overcoming obstacles. Okay. So yesterday, your teacher should have shown you this video about our new person, and his name is Alex Hunold, and I don't know if I'm pronouncing that right, Hunold or Hunold, mm. but he basically has like done some, like you know that a couple months ago when we talked about the guy that was like the um, tightrope walker? Tight walker, he's kind of like another sort of like daredevilist in my personal opinion, because I feel like every time he does these things, he's like putting his life in danger, mm. but he like rock climbs, He's an extreme rock climber, and he does it without, like, protective equipment. Oh, like harnesses and things like that. Yeah, so, like, oh. one of the things he's, I don't know if any of you guys have ever been to Yosemite before, but there's, like, this huge, like, rock wall, and it's called El Capitan, and he actually climbed that with his bare hands, which is just, yeah, my, I'm just not built for rock climbing, so, like... It just, like, no. amazes me, to be honest with you. I feel like I've been rock climbing, fake rock climbing, like, at a, we used to, Dick's Sporting Goods, that's still a thing, right? Yeah. And they used to have those rock walls in Dick's Sporting Goods when I was a kid, and I would, like, beg my parents to go there and rock climb. No. Um, I definitely outgrew that. No rock climbing for me. But whatever floats your boat. Anyways, we're super excited to celebrate him and learn all about how he overcame his challenges and obstacles to become the person that he is today. Yeah, you're never gonna see Mrs. O'Brien rock climbing. No, I don't. I don't. Nothing think about it is like enjoyable. I actually for don't me. think any of our staff rock climbs. No, but my daughter likes rock climbing, but she's like, you know, little. So yeah, it's a little different. Anyway. Okay. Oh, tomorrow, big day. We need like all. We need to be all in for this. Oh yeah. Tomorrow we are doing. We're. Tomorrow is our day to give back to the community, and we are teaming up with the Leukemia and Lymphoma Society. And I'm sure if we all had a conversation, we could all think of someone in our life who has suffered and who has had cancer. Um, and so tomorrow is our hat day for Read Across America Week. It can be any type of hat. It could be like a fancy hat, like you wear to the Derby, Ooh. or it could be a baseball hat or like I have a cheese hat because I'm a Packer fan. I can't wait to like, I can't wait for hat day. But like bring in a dollar. Tomorrow you have to bring in a dollar if you wear a hat. Our goal is to earn $400. Oh, totally doable, yeah. boys and girls. And if your parents want to donate more than a dollar just because it's towards a good cause, that's okay too. Lovely. Okay. okay. Please remember to follow your Cubs expectations so that our vision can come true. And our vision is in an ever-changing world, we can lead, we can learn, we can inspire. Thanks, and have a yes kind of day. Bye, Bye guys. guys.